I'm at the Edelman Fossil Park Quarry, a four acre, 45 foot deep hole in the ground. And the dinosaurs went extinct 66 million years ago when an asteroid hit the coast off the Yucatan Peninsula, blew a giant crater in the Earth's crust. All that rock went up into the atmosphere, went into space, when it came back in, it heated up the atmosphere such that it got globally somewhere between toaster oven and pizza oven that day. If you're a dinosaur and you're living on the surface of the Earth, you're toast at that moment. So, so dinosaurs which dominated Earth's terrestrial ecosystems for the better part of 165 million years, I think were functionally extinct within an hour after that impact. Now that impact layer from the debris, the iridium dust and the shock quartz and the glass spherules that rained down upon the planet, that layer has been found in over 350 spots around the world but precious few fossils have been found in that layer. A, a vertebra and a tooth in Poland, the same thing in Missouri, some fish scales in Belgium, in North Dakota, there's a, a pile of paddlefish and a, and a beautifully preserved dinosaur leg, but that's about it. And I began to search out this layer early in my career and uh, looked for it and, and found it in many cases in, in North Africa, in Patagonia, in the Gobi Desert, in the, in the foothills of the Himalayas, Montana, Wyoming. But even though I was able to find that layer on many occasions, there weren't really any fossils in it. And then I started working here. And at the bottom of this quarry, that layer is preserved, but with the fossils. It's the deathbed of the dinosaurs. It's the best window on the planet into the last moments of the dinosaurs, that pivotal calamitous day that wipes out the dinosaurs and really made the modern world as we know it. And in the last 17 years, my crew and myself excavating only 250 square meters here have collected over 100,000 fossils representing over 100 extinct species, each one of them a literal victim of the asteroid impact that happened 1,500 miles from here. This place is a global treasure.